Should I do it? Should I, should I do it? Should I do it? Should I, should I do it? Yeah. Hey, what's up guys? Royal here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at why I say that air attacks are the meta, guys. We got three different attacks, three different air type attacks. Gonna be smashing bases, and we're gonna get into it, guys, right after this. Alright, guys, so we're gonna get into our first attack here, and we've got Discretion coming in with a Queen Walk Lalo, guys. And I'm not doing these in any particular order. They're not going from, you know, the strongest to uh, least strongest or vice versa. We're just gonna start off with the uh, lowest base on the war map and work our way towards the top. So we got Discretion here, uh, starting with that uh, funnel with that baby dragon in the eastern corner. We got the. Uh, queen going down, a coconut loon to take out the seeking air mine, and then our healers down. Yeah, we want to protect those healers, guys, so we get that uh, balloon in, take the hit from the seeking air mine, so our healers don't, of course. We got the king coming in the north now, and the king is just going to uh, make a nice funnel and just do a ton of clearing out. Uh, taking out this town hall too in a minute here. The queen working on the ice golem coming out of the clan castle. Uh, didn't get the... Uh, dragon out just yet, so the poison was a little preemptive, but making a nice push here in the northeastern compartment. The dragon comes out now. The queen's going to be able to still take it out, not a problem. Going to take out the eagle now, and then the air defense. So this whole uh, northeastern compartment uh, getting taken out by the queen walk. Really valuable stuff here. Coming in with that Lalo now, guys, and that Stone Slammer from the uh, east, the southeast, and we're going to work our way in here from the south, and uh, we're going to get a couple of haste down here. We're going to get a Rage going in uh, towards the core of these uh, defenses here, a heal going into this multi-target Inferno, and... Look at this warden. This warden ability like literally gets nothing and it, there's so much inside of that warden. Uh, the, uh, uh, what do you call it? <laughs> the aura is aura. <laughs> but yeah, th that's kind of crazy how like nothing actually got uh, his ability there. But nonetheless, smash this base. And uh, yeah, now it's just up to the cleanup guys. Really smooth hit by discretion taking out their uh, number 14 this is a mirror hit right here real good stuff queen walk lala smashes bases guys we're gonna get into the next one right after this all right guys so in our next attack here we got kraken and he is coming in with that electro dragon attack he's got an electro drag back guys so uh, Electro Dragons are a really strong army to use. Uh, another one of those uh, meta armies, guys. And in this one, instead of just using the Rages and the Freezes, we are coming in with those Bat Spells, guys. Kraken's going to start off in the eastern corner and in the southeast uh, with those heroes. Going to do some nice... Uh, Carving out a piece of the sides here, just making the base a little bit tighter uh, for those Electro Dragons to come in and uh, just basically have a clear shot at the Town Hall, trimming down those sides, guys. Like you can see here, uh, the Electro Dragon up in the north takes out a whole uh, line of buildings from the north uh, western there and now that the base is nice and thin, we're coming in uh, all our stuff here coming right towards that town hall and there is so much firepower coming into that town hall guys we got that warden ability going down gonna keep us uh, protected through that gigabomb and the bat spells just come down guys and absolutely obliterating this base it just has fallen so fast guys like there's less than 20 seconds left and there's, I don't think, oh, maybe one Electro has died so far. We still got our Slammer going. We still got a whole whack of bats going. This base has been crushed, and Kraken just did not go easy on it at all. Real good job here by Kraken in his YouTube uh, 
debut. <laughs> Gonna get into the next one, guys, right after this. Guys, okay, so we're getting into our last attack now, and we got yours truly coming in here with a little bit of an unconventional attack. Maybe something you haven't seen, uh, but we got the Gobo Lalo, guys. So the idea here is we're going to come in with the Gobo uh, and the heroes, going to try and take out this sort of area of compartment, uh, all of this here, uh, take out the Town Hall, take out the Queen, take out the Eagle, take out these Expos, and what we're going to do then is bring the Lalo in, guys, and we're going to work our way around these air defenses since they're all on the outer sides here, and we are also not going to be battling these sweepers in that uh, scenario. So we're going to play it here and we're going to see how it unfolds. Uh, so we're going to get a golem down. Golem's going to do a little bit of tanking here. And we're going to send in some bowlers here to start doing a little bit of a funnel. The uh, wizard tower here didn't reach the golem. So the bowlers actually got taken out there. But it's okay. Going to send a couple more here. And we are just establishing that funnel, guys. We're going to bring the Stone Slammer into this one because, of course, a Wall Wrecker wouldn't really get much uh, done in this instance. It's just going to go straight for that Town Hall, right, guys? So uh, the Stone Slammer able to open up some walls here. Going to be having some Valkyries pop out from inside. Have a nice uh, jump spell to lead into the eagle compartment and as you can see here guys just totally taking out the whole uh, northern section of the base taking out all these defenses and uh, taking out the CC which wasn't you know super valuable to take out of course for an air attack because it was a hound and some loons but we took out the CC and now we got the Lalo portion coming in from the western side of the base guys and we're gonna be able to haste spell them around and you can see the pathing that we've created here we got our second hound coming in followed by some more loons and we are just gonna work our way around uh, use the haste as we need them here and uh, our hounds are just gonna do some of that tanking they actually uh, had uh, activated the tornado trap over in the uh, eastern corner so our balloons didn't uh, have to eat it which was kind of nice there uh, we got the haste and a heal spell. Always good to have that heal spell, guys, on the back end of a base. If you're going to be ending on a wizard tower, because a wizard tower can do devastating damage to your balloons. And right now, we don't have a ton of balloons still going, but they're going to head over and try and take out this archer tower we got our uh, warden with our king and some uh, minions and lava pups working in the south and trying to work their way around here balloons gonna go to this outside tesla here uh we got how many balloons here one one balloon left <laughs> real clutch job here by the balloon uh might be a it's got to be one. Oh, there's two. There's definitely two there. <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're going to be able to take out the rest of this base, guys. Uh, real clutch uh, move here. And uh, bringing out that Gobo Lalo, guys. It's all about base identification. But really showing here just how strong air attacks are. And honestly, uh, how uh, wide of a variety of air attacks that there are in the game to be honest and that is why guys air is the meta if you think so if you just liked these uh, replays in general slap that like button for me guys and if you haven't already go subscribe to the channel really appreciate that i'm gonna leave it at that you guys all have a good one peace out Step,